New research shows there are video games that can improve kids' impulse control and memory. But how do video games fare against traditional board games? News 9's Robin Marsh has the answer in today's Medical Minute. Well, some video games get a bad reputation for being linked to obesity and vision problems in young people with excessive use. But there are positive to video games. When used in medical applications, video games can train people with degenerative diseases to improve their balance and even help adolescents with ADHD improve thinking skills. But what about when it comes to memory? An active mind might be a protected mind. You're exercising your brain, your, your neurons, your neurofunctions. One study from Vermont University found that kids who played video games for three hours a day or more actually perform better on cognitive skills testing involving working memory. That's compared to kids who never played video games. And for older adults, researchers from Columbia University and even Duke found crossword puzzles actually have an advantage over video games when it comes to memory function. They found there was less brain shrinkage, which is associated with Alzheimer's. And for those who work crossword puzzles compared to those who played video games, researchers found that crossword puzzles benefit those with both early and late stages of cognitive decline. For today's Medical Minute, I'm Robin Marsh.